How often do you look at other states to see what they're doing in terms of funding and in terms of classroom and results to see how you guys measure up uh, state by state? We were having a discussion earlier. Um, there's We have 102 counties in Illinois, and Mark mentioned I think 24 of them have passed sales facilities tax uh, on the ballot. They put it on the voters vote for it, where that can help districts with their infrastructure and get new buildings and funding. Iowa has it statewide. So they have a sales facilities tax, which schools can tap into. It's about a 1% tax. So for example, in Sangman County, we tried to pass it about three years ago and it lost. And the revenue that we would have gained from that to help our facilities was about $30 million for about uh, 10 different school districts. So sell it on the point that people that come to visit the Lincoln sites, that come to town, those are the kind of uh, taxes that would go towards that fund and but it didn't pass it didn't pass in bob's area i think do you have in a couple i have i have two counties where they passed it one where it was unsuccessful but when it comes time for them to vote to give us more taxes to improve the schools um and then you talk about these measures losing at the right. ballots how frustrating how frustrating is it to you as administrators and superintendents and, and leaders in these districts to, to see that happen and how can you get through to the parents who, who pay the bills? You, you know, I don't, just personally, I, my frustration isn't even necessarily with the, with the taxpayers. It really isn't because the, the way we're currently structured in Illinois, we continually have to go back to our local property tax owners uh, in order to provide adequate funding because the state's not carrying their fair share. Mm -hmm. And so, um, yeah, is it frustrating if you if you are in part of a campaign at a district level? Yeah, they probably are, but I, I don't really get frustrated with with the taxpayers because they they feel like they are carrying a pretty significant burden as it is on, on their local property taxes. But if you're effective in in communicating that message to your local con constituency and they and the, and they embrace what you're saying, then that's that's fine. They'll get fine. the vote. So, yeah. yeah well, I, fortunately, uh, in Madison County last year, we did pass. We had one district that passed an increase in their ed education rate fund. It was a triad district, but unfortunately, Granite City did not. So. Uh, once again, uh, the disparity by funding by property taxes creates more of haves and haves not. Well, so. What is the solution? A statewide across the board tax then? Uh, Instead I, of a regional one? I, th I think that we need a, a more proportional sh cost share between property tax and state funding, okay, which more or less looks at more of a qualitative approach as to you know, income levels. Because in some regions, you're not going to ever pass a tax increase because the level, the standard of living in those mm. communities just isn't there. There is no EAV, for example, that's, that schools can operate on. So those schools naturally depend a lot more on state funding than those affluent communities that have, you know, higher equalized assessed valuations. Right. Yeah, so let's say you have a real ritzy area. There's right. a lot of property taxes, right. so they have money for their schools. Do they get the same amount as a real poor area from the state, or do they balance it out? Do they try to, if you've they, got a ton of property right. tax money, then you don't need right. that state money? The foundation level right now in Illinois is $6,119. But okay? it's being prorated. That, that's right. So, but you'll have a district, like I have districts that get, maybe get $900 per student, more wealthy districts, and then we have districts that get over $4,000 per student from the state. So they do take that into they, they account. They take that into which account. Which would make yeah. sense.